I'm heading back to Scotland today and the reason I've only stayed in New York for three nights is because I have to get back for the North Coast 500 trip on the 8th of September which is this Saturday which means I'm leaving the Dodge Challenger here in New York until I can come back after the North Coast 500 trip. However, I need to get the Challenger all the way down to Mexico and that's two and a half thousand miles from New York. So that part of the journey begins today because I need to make a list of everything that that Challenger needs just to make it drive, just to find out if I can actually get it to Mexico. So the Challenger is gonna to have to be made roadworthy and that process will begin today before I go home because I need to make a list of everything that the Challenger needs done to it so that I can order all of those parts when I get home and then after the North Coast 500 come back out here to New York and then fit all the parts of the Challenger and try and make that car drive and get it down to Mexico. That is my old bag, I won't be needing that anymore. So we're back at the Challenger now, and honest to god, I cannot thank Ira enough for storing it for me. It looks absolutely the business sitting in here uh, in a barn. This is like the dream location you'd expect to find something like this. So now I'm going to start a list of everything that this car needs to make it drive, so I can see if it's going to be possible to drive this car to Mexico. So I'm checking things like tyres and the condition of them. These tyres are shot, they need replaced. They look okay, they've got loads of tread on them, but they're perished, they're really old tyres. So I've got the size, it's a 225-7814. So, so far on the list I've got four wheel cylinders, brake shoes, flexi hoses, fuel tank, master cylinder. The master cylinder is literally C solid, that's for the brakes. No brakes, press the brake pedal, it just does not move, it's like a rock. Uh, four tyres, oil and oil filter, that's unheard of for me. There's a little rubber grommet needed for the clutch pedal to stop the fumes coming in from the engine bay. Uh, windscreen's shattered, so I mean it's cracked but it's still there, but it needs a windscreen. Wiper blades, um, driver's door window winder handle thing. Carb gasket set. And I'm not even being funny, it's so, so hot in here. That's me, I've got my list of stuff that I need to do to the Challenger. Uh, now it's time to say goodbye and I shall see you again after the North Coast 500, uh, where I'll hopefully be coming back to drive this car very far. So we're back in New York now, and I need to head to the airport like pretty soon, about an hour. So the last thing I want to do before I go is try a proper, real American slice of pizza. In this place, it's called the uh, Joey's Pepperoni's Pizza, so let's try it. Well, that was some exceptionally good pizza. I had four slices, very, very tasty. Highly recommend uh, Joey's Pepperoni's, whatever the hell it's called, I can't remember. A really good pizza. Um, now it's time to head back to the airport. It's six o'clock. I've got a long flight to Manchester. I don't know why I'm going to Manchester. And then another flight up to Edinburgh uh, and arrive tomorrow morning. So I kind of don't want to leave New York. It's been a lot of fun, although I do feel like I've completed my mission of acquiring the Dodge Challenger for the Rusty Mexico Car Rally. I'm now looking forward to get back from the North Coast 500. Also, I'm feeling very satisfied that the trip was a success. Also feeling that I've opened up a whole new adventure, which means the Dodge Challenger, uh, 
at another road trip to Mexico and God knows what else. So really looking forward to it. I better go and get my Uber, it's gonna be here any minute. Anyway, see you soon. I don't know what I was going to say. And I can see myself in that piece of glass and it's really off-putting, I don't know why. I felt clean and fresh this morning until I came here into this oven and I'm absolutely sweating. I swear I'm not going to come back here until it's winter. I'm sweating. Which means I'm leaving. I've moved again. I love talking to the camera. Oh, like, I'm really good at it. Me and the camera, we're best buddies. Me and my 5D. I keep looking down because the screen's there. This 5D does not have a flip out screen. This is my flip out screen. Bye.